On a sunny Friday morning, the cafeteria at Blaine Elementary School is buzzing with second graders who just wrapped up lunch. In a single file line, they navigate a battery of plastic bins. Second grader Chloe explains what's happening. If you have any leftover food or anything that you don't want to eat, then you can compost it in the compost bin. The other food that you throw away that you think that you can't compost, it has to go to a landfill and it makes all these gases that are really bad. Chloe and her classmates are part of an eight-week pilot program that collects lunch scraps every Friday and sends them off to a commercial composter. All schools should do this because the planet would be a better place. Composting is very important because more composting means less garbage. I think that is really good because we aren't wasting food. If anything, we're just one, saving the earth and helping it to be a better place, and it will also help grow more plants, and then we might go on some more nature walks and pick up more garbage to help the environment. It's actually really nice because most of my food's compostable. Otherwise, when we have more garbage, there's more like pollution heat, and it's bad for us, and it's bad for plants and things like that. You put the food in the compost bin, and it turns into compost. The people back there help you, and they sort items, and like what they tell you what bins you put the, your food in. Once I was eating some carrots, and I didn't finish them, so I th so I put it in the compost bin. Don't just throw like trash on the ground, like um, cheeseburgers or pizza on the ground. You can go throw them out in a compost bin instead of throwing it on the ground because if you put it in the landfill, then um, it's not good for the planet too. Finally, the biggest goal is to grow a new crop of zero waste ambassadors. And from the sounds of the precocious kids at Blaine, this crop is well on its way to taking root.